All right, boys and girls, it's time for children's worship, so come on down. Everyone take your seat on the steps. Let's see what's in the box today. Okay, there's a note here. This, oh, I like it when there's help. It says, do something that has to do with both of them, please. I'm not sure if that's help or not. This is strawberry turtle and axolot. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay, so this, this must be strawberry turtle. And this is axolot. What is... It's an amphibian. An amphibian. An axolotl. Oh, it's not not an axolot. It's an axolotl. That really is an. That's a real animal, a real amphibian. Okay, all right. I don't know what an axolotl is. What's it like? Is it like a salamander? Is it like a lizard? It's a reptile. Okay, okay. Well, that didn't help me much. I don't think. You want me to do something with both of them? Okay. All right. I have a question. Did you happen to make these? Ah, there we go. Because I know she is a, what is that crocheting? Is that what that is? She crochets. I happen to know that. So, um, okay, so you made these. Did you have a pattern that you came, or did you do it like just on your own? I watched a video. You, good old YouTube, right? So you made these, and you followed a pattern, and then look at these wonderful creations. That's really good. That's really good. Strawberry turtle and axolotl. How many of you know sometimes it's one thing when you could read about something being done, but when you can watch someone do it and they show you, whether it's like showing you and with you there or YouTube, it's, it's really a lot easier when someone shows you how to do something. Are you that one of the, how many of you are the kind of people that like to show, if someone shows you, you can learn it better, right? How many of you are the kind of kids that sometimes you can read about it and you can learn it just by reading about it? All right? I'm sort of not that way. I like to have someone show me, or if I can see it, it really helps me, really helps me. And once you learn how to do something, then if you watch it, then that becomes your pattern for how to do it. And you learn new skills because someone showed you how to, how to do it. All right? Oh, my, there are so many wonderful ways that we could talk about today about what it means to, um, to learn and to grow. Sometimes you can learn and grow by your own mistakes. How many of you made some mistakes before? I'll bet even when you were doing this, you probably had to do some stitches and undo stitches. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes you learn by your mistakes. Sometimes you learn by other people's mistakes. Right? You watch what they do. How many of you have watched one of your siblings get in trouble and you're like, I am not going to do that? Yeah, you're learning from other people's mistakes, right? Um, and then sometimes you learn by watching other people's um, good, positive examples, right? And that's what happened here. You see these, po she went to YouTube and found out how to make strawberry and axolotl, strawberry, um, um, strawberry turtle and axolotl saw how it's done and then she saw that good example and said hey I can do that and followed a good example now in your life do you know that there are a lot of ways you can learn sometimes you learn by your own mistakes sometimes you learn by your own successes things you do well sometimes you learn from other people's mistakes and sometimes you learn from other people's successes and as you learn, I hope that you are humble enough to say, you know what, I need to watch people wisely because I can learn from somebody else. Watch wisely, ask questions. And then you'd be amazed what you can learn. Sometimes we watch wisely and we say, you know, that person made some very foolish choices and I want to learn from them. In fact, when you read the Bible, that's a lot of what you read in the Bible. You'll read people and sometimes people are really wise and we say, hey, that's an example for me to follow. Sometimes people are very foolish and we say, hey, that's an example for me not to follow. It's a pattern to follow, a pattern not to follow. And in your life, you want to learn from the people that you watch and you have to decide whose pattern am I going to follow? Do I want to follow a pattern that honors Jesus or I'm going to choose my own way? 
And you have to decide, everybody in each family, you have to decide, who am I going to follow? An example that follows Jesus or someone that doesn't. Every young person has to decide. Every adult has to decide. Everybody goes through things. Whose example am I going to follow? An example that helps me to honor Jesus Christ or an example that chooses a way that doesn't honor the Lord? And hey, let's choose a great pattern because look what cool things happen when somebody follows the right pattern. That was very, very good. I'm going to give you axolotl. I've never seen an axolotl, never heard of an axolotl, so there's something new today. I'm going to have to go to YouTube and look up an axolotl. Okay? All right. All right, let me give this away. Let's give this to you. Who's going to take that? Oh, you all don't want it? I'm telling you what. All right, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to let you girls fight over who gets to have that. No, you're not going to fight. You're going to decide. Y'all, hey, girls, 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 you pray about it. Pray about it and ask God to show you who should have the box, okay? That doesn't happen very often. It's a, it's a, it's a Sunday miracle right there. All right? Guys and gals, thank you so much. You can go back to your seats at this time.